decided it was important to show how to set ZenWord up from a blank WordPress site and a new uh, Zenforo site that has already been installed. So this is a WordPress site that is newly installed and at this point we can see that um, there the bio is coming from WordPress you can see the author length etc you can also see the widgets on the right hand side um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to set this up so that um, Zenforo becomes the master in terms of user information and then ZenWord is going to help bridge things. So we're just going to start with logging into the admin. We're going to go in with our old WordPress ID and the password. We set this up. I've already enabled ZenWord, but it's not active. If we go in, it'll say hey, the, Zen, the uh, Zenforo is, uh, is not recognized yet. And this is because the absolute path has not been set correctly. I'm simply on a development environment, so this is example number three. I'm just going to grab that, put it in. I'm going to click on Save. When I do that, come over here. It's now redirecting to Zenforo. I'm going to log in. As soon as I log in, come back. And you can see now it says, hey, uh, this alpha version here uh, is, is working correctly. And it sees Zenforo properly. So at this point, things seem to be connected. But if we go to the site, we really can't tell. If I hover over this information in the right, I'll see immediately it's taking me to the Zenforo profiles. That's good and the logout, etc., is going out through Zenforo. If I go now into the uh, um, into some of the other areas, though, I'm not really getting getting very good information, and I'm kind of seeing some stuff here that I don't like. Plus, my my widgets are not good. So let's go fix the widgets first, so I can easily log in and out. I'm just going to remove these. And once I've done that, I'm going to come over here. I'm going to add in a login. I'm going to get rid of this information and save it. And after login, I'm going to go ahead and put in who else is around. No members online. And I'm going to do a board totals, so I can see the boards. And now I go look. Things are starting to look a little bit better. By putting this over on the right side, I now can log in and out very quickly and easily. I can log in and out on the, um, the WordPress side. So I can log in and out. I'm going to go ahead and get rid of, of these on top. Do that by going to the WordPress toolbar, and I'm just going to turn off those links. Okay. I'm also going to make sure that I have version 4.5 set. I'm going to set up a default user. I'm going to map. I'm going to turn this on and I'm going to set this up. So administrative, etc. is administrator. But more importantly, I'm going to set up something like this so that uh, the registered person is a customer. I'm going to I'm not going to allow an unregistered person if I don't want to, or maybe just make them a subscriber. 
That's better. Um, or just leave it, leave it blank, if you'd like. Administrator for WordPress. This is coming from Zenforo side. I set these secondary user groups up so anyone can be moved at the change the roles by changing things at the Zenforo side. I'm going to go ahead and save that. In terms of avatars, leave that synchronized. In terms of authors, I'm going to go ahead and, uh, and make some changes. In terms of the redirects, threads, I'm going to add in the tag system. Enable that. Change my link. I'm going to look at this. I don't want to use a comment count. I'm just going to go ahead and uh, uh, let's, let's do a comment count. Comment system is enabled. I'm going to display things de by default. I don't want to change anything there. Once I'm happy with that, I'm going to go out and look. I'll kind of look and make sure all the tokens are correct, everything's set. Log in and out, that's happy. Now I need a menu across here because I don't have a menu. Excuse me. I need, I need to create a menu that is uh, main navigation. Learn how to spell. And dogs making noise. Make sure that's primary. And then let's go ahead and do some custom links. Set this up. This is home. And set this up as community. And add that. Save. And now on this side, I have a community link. So I can go back and forth between WordPress and Zenforo. So that's nice. I see my community stats, etc. I'm then going to uh, test post at this point. And I'm just going to go ahead and say uh, this is a test post. Um, this is a test post. It's boring and nothing is really here to see. Uh, this is a boring test post. I'm going to go ahead and in terms of the forms I'm going to put it in send word. Don't need to, I can put it anywhere I want. Um, let's just do a send word tag like this. Let's do Zenforo tag, let's do WordPress tag. Let's grab a featured image. Select something um, let's see, let's go to uh, downloads, I have my in here, well, let's do that, that's cool, let's set that, let's go look at it, we'll preview it, there we go. Boring old test. Notice that the author is now redirecting. Pretty cool. Okay. Uh, I like what I see. I'm going to go ahead down here, make sure the comments are allowed. I could put it in uh, any category I wish. I'm just going to leave that alone. I'm going to go ahead and publish. Now I can go to publish and see it, but more importantly, there's a link to the forum. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and come back. You'll also see down here that there's a place to leave a reply or a comment. So I'm going to um, I'm leave that for a moment, go back up front, make sure I'm happy. Okay, and I'm happy with what I see. I can log out. I'm going to log in as Albert. Make sure that he's he's all happy and can see he's online. 
I'm also then going to come over to uh, uh, Safari. I'm going to refresh here. And this seems to be good. This seems to be behaving. I'm going to come in now as Kerry and type that in. There's Kerry. Go to our test post. And you'll notice I have a plugin called WP Discuss that's installed. And um, what I'm going to do is Curie is going to post. So Curie posts a um, comment on the WordPress side. Okay. And it's there. Comment is awaiting moderation. Poor Curie. I'm going to come over and um, log in. Let's go to comments. Let's approve, Kerry. Let's go back out. Let's go in. Let's see, I was with Albert, wasn't I? And Albert, he's down here. He sees this post, this comment. All right, or maybe he's in the thread itself where Curie posted, and he posts, Albert posts from the Zinforo side. This should show up on the WordPress side. I'm going to go there. We're going to post look in. And there it is. So this allows us to uh, to sort things a little bit differently. We're using default WordPress things rather than prior versions. We can also vote on things, etc. Um, what's nice? Let me log out. Log in. What's nice? Is we can go to the um, comments, go to settings of WP Discuss, and we can go to live update, and we can change this to live update. So now what's going to happen is I'm going to post something here, but I'm first going to come over to, to this. So this is Curie on this side. I'm going to go ahead and um, come in over as LPH. I'm going to post. This is a uh, live update post from WordPress. This should show up on uh, Curie's um, browser. Post. This is a live update, etc. I'm going to go back here. I'm going to wait. And it should. I think I said save. There it is. It's a live update. So I didn't refresh or anything that came came through on its own. More importantly, I can come here. And there it is. Now, one of the sticklers you might have noticed, and this is why it's the comment count was wrong for a moment. And um, that's because this section refreshed, but this did not. Okay, anyway, I've taken it from uh, a, a brand new WordPress site, then have different, um, different features in terms of the comments, comment counts, and everything looks fine. Um, this will take me, take me in. Live updates seem to work. Redirects seem to work. Being able to uh, um, redirect to... Uh, um, to the authors and things like that. Okay, all of that seems to work. Pull down here, 
Look in the edit, it's even going to the right place if I'm trying to edit my profile. Okay, or if I just want to log out from here, it logs out. Okay, I hope that helps.